So finally, my bike wheel came in. Woo! Um, I do have three bike signs, and I have showed these in the past. I have one that says, Seek Beautiful Things and Follow the Sun. Thank you, Levon. They were, in, they were inspired by this ribbon to go with that ribbon. Then this one says, Stop and Smell the Flowers. I kind of wanted a different color. So I went with um, these colors. Hi, Kathy. Hi, Esther. Hi, Tracy. Hi, Nanny Dot. Okay, so we're going to be actually working with this sign tonight. So I still don't have a hole punch. It hasn't come in, but that's okay. So how many were over at um, Susan's Live? I know LeVon was. Did any of you see the new sign? I'll show you the one that she worked with. Um, and the sign was totally inspired by Susan. She told me she had a, a wreath that she wanted to make. And she had this magnolia ribbon that had the um, seersucker in it. And that's the one that she wanted me to, she showed me all those ribbon that she used. And it was like, oh my gosh, how am I going to get all that in there? And then I started playing around with it and came up with this and she flipped over it. So that's all it took. Um, so hi, Kathy. Hi, Cindy. Hi, Sue. Who else did I say? Hi, Ann everybody's jumping on thank you okay so sue did this did this sign justice this was all her her doing um but that's one of the signs the signs i'll be showing you tonight are all this like galvanized look and then there are two that aren't um i went ahead and i already posted them on my etsy shop so they'll be available immediately I just didn't post pictures yet in case anybody sneaked. All right, so we're going to go ahead and use this bike sign tonight, which was inspired by these little bikes I got last year at AC Moore, the little picks, and also this ribbon. And this ribbon came from Sims, and I just love this ribbon. Why am I not getting scrolly things? Oh, come on. Ah, uh, there's Susan. You did an awesome job. Hi, Dawn. All right, so we're just going to release them a little bit at a time. So we're going to start with the bike wreath here that I'm working on. This is a bike wheel. Okay. And I cut these at 30. I just wanted a simple color because I'm going to dress it up with, um, with the ribbons. Okay, I hope you all are staying safe. As some of you know, we lost a very important family member on Friday night to the, to the virus. So things have not settled down some, but we're hanging in there. See, I wanted it just to pop against the white. My red one didn't come in, but my white one did. So, thank you everybody for spreading the love. I appreciate it. You did an amazing job, Susan. I loved it. So all I'm doing is using my tinsel ties, which I cut at 12 inches, and I'm just going in between the spokes. Well, I should have put these on first. Like I said, I'm a little bit crazy trying to get through what we're dealing with. So I appreciate all you jumping on and all of you sharing. I cut 10 of these at 30 because I don't want to cover the whole thing. I want the, 
I want the wheel to show. And I know everybody's getting antsy to stay home, you know, to get out of the house and, and get away. But let me tell you, don't come out until you know things are safe. Use your head. I know everybody is anxious to get back to work, but our family members that are in nursing homes are sitting ducks for this disease, and it takes them like that. So we need to be cautious. I know it's frustrating. But I think I can go every other one with this. So let's do this. Let's put one there. Now we'll put one here and then we'll move that one up after we tie this one down. I know you, a lot of you saw that little saying I posted. I will be making a sign in memory of my mother-in-law and uh, I, I just need to think about it for a while that was the only image I found that I loved so it is what it is right there I think that's where I want it next one up Okay, so I'm going every other spook. Thank you, Dawn. Um, the wheel, Deborah, came from Sims. Oh. Hi, Wilhelmina. Hi, Trish. Thank you. Hi, Kathy. I hope I'm not missing anybody. Hi, Carol. I don't think I missed anybody. It is actually a 16 inch wheel, bike wheel. I've been watching, they, 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 didn't, they didn't have any in and then I needed some ribbon and boy, boom, there it was. And since the other company is messing with me, I ordered the beginning of April, April 4th to be exact, and they told me they're 10 days out and still no sign of shipping. And I ordered from Sims last week on Wednesday, no, Thursday, and had it by Friday. So, because I'm waiting to release my patriotic gnome and I need the bases and I am getting so angry. I get it. I realize they have, you know, they have limited staff. I get it, but you know, don't keep taking orders if you can't get out what you what you have. Okay, so again, we're going to every other one with 30 inch mesh, 10 inch mesh at 30 inches ruffles. Sorry, guys, I'm losing again. I just wanted frilly and girly looking. And I wanted the colors in the sign to play off the mesh and the picks. So, I should put this down there. There we go. A little bit slow these last couple days. So. Is it time to show a sign yet? All right, let's show the first one. Now this, I showed you the one that Susan revealed already. Can you read it? It says Magnolia Meadows Farm. I think it is showing the right, yep. Okay, the second one I have is 
ye yellow petal flower farm. These are all my designs. The background looks galvanized, but it's not. These signs are all, the metal is made in USA, UV protected. Thank you, Bobby. I put all the, um, the sunflowers on there. I put the background in there too. I'm learning how to do all these and I'm having a ball. So that's our second sign. And when I get somebody like Sue that contacts me and says, it's such a creative challenge, you don't wanna stop. In fact, I think that day I ended up making four more. <laughs> so it's, it's helping me with the loss, it's helping me with being stuck inside and my creativity level has gone up. So why it's up, I gotta take advantage of it. This is just regular deco mesh from Sims. Okay. I may stop at eight see how far we go here but I appreciate all of you stopping by and spreading the love somebody had asked me about the bike ribbon to match the other bikes I did find more so I'll post that on Etsy because I ended up selling out of it so I will post more scissors that you guys just love. My upholstery scissors. It is not working. Oh, thank you, Mary. It's nice to be able to have a hand in what you what you're making and and creating it from start to finish. And it's been a, a great challenge. And I'm doing this without software, y'all. <laughs> I just bought software today. So I find my inspirations here and there and so I think it's the thrill of the hunt to find the pieces to go with it. Doesn't this pink look awesome against the white? All right, I think that's all I'm gonna put on. So I ended up putting one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I ended up putting eight in every other one. because right? I think once I find once I find something to poke a hole in this I think I'm going to put that right there or I may go up here and put a nice big ribbon to go down here all right let's let's go to one of the whimsical signs okay this one says I licked it so it's mine I thought this would be really cute for um, summertime. Thank you, Becky. Welcome. Isn't that cute? <laughs> He's got his tongue in his nose. <laughs> you know me. I have to throw one in there that is funny. Just have to. You gotta, you gotta laugh at life every now and then. 
because if you don't, you're going to cry. So, let me see. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to do tails like we would on a wreath. I'm going to do them at, let's try 13 inches. Let's get a few tails on and then we'll release another one. I thank you all for spreading the love and hanging out. And what I'm doing with these, I'm actually matching all the colors in the sign with these colors. Because as you can see, my flowers have yellow dots in the middle. So that's what we're doing. Oh my gosh, does that pop or what? And I may or may not go back and put um, flowers in it. I may just stick with the uh, with the bike picks. I don't know. It's it's going to be work in progress. Except I don't think I want to use the green ribbon. So um, I don't want to use the pink. was going to use, eh, maybe I will use the green, because we got green in there. And we got green in this too. So let's go ahead and use these too. Welcome Donna, thank you for joining. Welcome Becky. If you guys hit those three little little buttons or those three little dots at the top of my page, it will alert you when I go live. That would be appreciated. If I miss your any of your questions, I will go back at the end. Uh, hi Nanny Dot. Welcome, Donna. <laughs> Cindy, these are all my signs. On my page is a Shop Now button that would take you directly to my um, Etsy page. And I have already pre-listed the signs, but I did not put pictures on yet. Because I didn't want anybody peeking ahead of time. So, you know what? I'm going to do something different. That's not, that's not what I want. So, you guys know I've done this before. I just want to figure out what size I want. Hi, Elaine. Hi, Thelma. Maybe Sue and Levon and Dawn can answer any questions and I'll just keep creating and then um, at the end, when I'm done, I will go back and check and see if anybody had any questions that weren't answered. That would be appreciated. I have, I think it's eight signs coming out. I want to do bows with a tail. I, I wanted to do something different and I'm going to do that. And I may just do this with this one. See, sometimes I have an idea in my head and then I change it. And that's what I'm going to do. Alright, this is going to get done over like that 
And then this one, I need more. This one I'm going to do like this. Only because I want it to be different. Welcome. Changing my mind again. Let me see. just see something else sorry guys it's my prerogative change my mind <laughs> and I'm doing it <laughs> I'm just gonna go straight with a bow of the one and a half inch and I'll tell you in a minute how long I'm cutting them and I may throw this in too So we get some yellow in there. So so let me see. So it's about 24 inches an inch piece that I'm cutting. Give or take. That might be a little too long. How do you like that? There's the end of the ribbon. And I just opened it. Don't you hate that? I think what I'll do is I'll get rid of this and I'll put a solid in between each one. So we're going to cut them at 18, like around 18, 19 inches. That's the look I'm going for. And that other look wasn't cutting it. And it may have something to do with the wheel. So let's go ahead. Yikes! Let's go ahead and use the purple in between, this deep purple that's in there. I could even use a solid pink, but I think I'll stick with these three and just do bows. Make it look girly and frilly. Cut it at about 18 inches. Let's move this. Give myself some space. Not get jumped up here. There we go. That's what I want. Just some bows. Or maybe I'll just do every other one the other one and then I'll put the bikes in between <sighs> I'm trying y'all it's like I said been a trying week so bear with me losses do different things to different people one and then we'll put one. I may just add some tubing in between. Maybe that's the look I'm going for. Some flowers and then just some simple tubing. I think that's what I need to do. Let me get this one on and then we'll show another sign. Oh, 
boy, it's telling me I got 32 new comments, but it's not showing them to me. Dang it. I'm sorry about that, everybody. All right. Now, I know I should have pulled the ribbon out for this. I know a lot of you will be doing strawberry wreaths, so here's the next one. It's Burry Farms Farmer's Market, homegrown and handmade. Again, it's got the seersucker in the middle. It's got the galvanized, rusty-looking edge on it. So that's the next one in the series. I tried to go with like late spring, early summer. I'm looking to see, I know I had tubing. Let me get some tubing. maybe some purple in there in between just yep to give it a little punch it's too big I think just to bring out some of the purple in the sign that's what I want. And I'm not measuring, I'm just eyeballing it. I know about how big I want my loops. So we've got flowers in there, which is what's in the sign. And then we're putting a little tubing in there to give it a little pop of color against the pink. I'm sorry, y'all. I lost all the comments. <laughs> Maybe that's what it is. We were talking about this earlier. They made the sign, the the screen bigger, but then you're losing the comments. That's what it is then. So what do you think of that so far? Again, I've totally lost you. Hey Jenny. Hey Jill. Hey Bobby. Hey Joy. All right, so this I think I think I'm gonna like put it let's see I think it's gonna go up there and then I'm gonna put a nice big trailing bow right here what do you think of that just scream springtime What do you think so far? Hearts, angry faces, what do you think? <laughs> I don't know who it was that was shooting Susan some angry faces, but I wasn't liking that. She's my girl. She doesn't deserve angry faces. All right, let's see. I'm going to use this with this with this and then I need something else in there. Let's go ahead and go with the yellow. Is that two? No, wait a minute. Let me see here. Let's go with a bright pink. Let's throw that in there. Yeah. All right. We got it figured out. A little slow, but we got it. Now, I 
think I think I'm gonna go with the easy bow or the yeah the easy bow. Let's put this here. That'll be nice for securing that on there. All right. Got my tinsel tie. Is it time to show another sign? All right. Here is the next one. Blueberry Farm. Again, we've got the seersucker in the middle. And some big, fat, juicy blueberries laying around. Woo, I'm getting hearts. Thank you. So don't waste anything. I'm going to hook two of these together. So, all right. We'll do about six inches. Come on, fingers. I don't know if you all got a chance to watch me on Lori's channel. I don't think you could see it. And I didn't tell anybody about it. But I cut my finger on live and it was bleeding. And I was using the red flowers because my apron is solid white. So I was using the red flowers to suck up some of the the bleeding going on it was horrible I thought I can't say anything I couldn't run and get a band-aid so I kept it all to myself so I don't think anybody noticed now you probably will if you go back and watch it so yeah it was a challenge. Maybe. Nah, I'll use this. Missy on. Missy did an awesome job on Saturday. I got all the timing messed up on that. Now I don't think I want these next to each other. So I'm going to put something in between. like four two four two so what color do I want in between nah. um, sorry I shouldn't be turning that way y'all see the back of my head went and cut my hair today. I need something solid. Let's just, no, no, that's not what I want. Let's go with, 
No, I don't want yellow. this one. Just put a little pop of purple in there. A little bit of lavender. As I'm done here, I'll show you another one. Now this is the one that Susan's going to use for her new kit. Isn't that cool? I found this vintage lemon sign, which really looks good against that um, galvanized. But that's the one Susan's doing for her wreath kit. Woohoo! I love this one and I stuck a little bow up in there just to frill it up a little bit make it look vintage and frilly Susan loves that one. I can't wait to see the wreath kit. I can't wait to see her do it. landed on my foot. <laughs> At least I didn't cut myself yet. Make a little bit shorter on this one. So, let's get this on here. And you know what I could have used? Dang it. I could have used this ribbon. It's kind of like a denim. And it would have matched the denim on this sign. Like, see down in the corner? Oh. 
That's why I put all of them there, so I'd have everything available to me. Duh. And these spokes are great for hanging stuff from. I almost bought a whole bike locally, a used bike, because it had purple rims on it. But I thought, then what do I do with the rest of the bike? My husband's going to be mad because he's going to have to junk the bike. So I didn't get it. <coughs> Excuse me. Why is that not coming down? Because I got it on two, and it can't come down because it's spreading out. So we don't want it up that high. <clears throat> there we go. Now that's where I want it. And I didn't need all that tie anyhow. So let's loop it around in here. I may go back and switch out that purple for a rosy or pink. pink or lighter purple. <clears throat> All right. Let me see. <clears throat> I think I want to tone it down, but I don't think this is the purple I want. So maybe the yellow would work better. Now, you know what? I think I like the white better. That's the color I want. It just tones it down some and makes your eyes play off of the ribbon instead. Just enough of a little glitter. Got to go back to the pink. Yes. Back to the pink. Because it's got that teal, it's got that purple in there. Yeah, that's what I want. Pink, that purple is just too dark. I don't want you focusing on the purple. I want you focusing on the flowers. Yep. And I'm not a pink girl. I guess because I'm a redhead. I don't like pink that much. I like blues and purples. I'll have to get rid of these tinsel ties. All right, let me put this last one in and then I'll show you the last two. And they're not as farmhouse as the first ones, but they make me think of summer. All right, what do you think of that? Where did my slang go? There it is. And I can put 
these in here too. I'm gonna have to play around with them and bend them a little. Maybe I will put them right with the yellow ribbon like that. Where's the third one? There we go. And then the last one I will put with the bow. There we go. That's what I wanted. How's that? What's with the angry face? Jeez. You guys are brutal. Not liking that. I had some like tiny flowers here. Nope. Nope. Plain and simple. Thank you, Suze. All right, so these are the last two. <gasps> oh no. I'm missing my cow one. One, two, three, four, five. Oh crap, my cow one's upstairs. Yep, sure is. I don't know if you want me to run up and get it. There's a little angry face on your um, row of little, six little things you can push, the little thumbs up or the heart or the smiley face or the surprise or the sad. Well, angry is next to the sad and somebody keeps pushing the angry button. And it's like, what? Do you all want me to run up and get my cow one? Why am I asking? I can't see any <laughs> comments. I'm seeing them on my phone now. Let me run up because he's really cute and it'll make you smile. Okay, sorry. All right, here he is. Isn't he adorable? He's eating daisies. And I thought, wouldn't this be cute with a bunch of daisies? And oh, I can just see that. So that's the last one in the eight I released today. Isn't he cute? What one's on the shelf? Oh, this one? Yeah, my other cow one. Aw, oh, thank you, Bobby. He is. He is so adorable. He has a big daisy in his mouth. And I thought, you know, you can do so much with this. I can just see, like... I have some really big daisies here. I can see the cow ribbon. I know I have cow ribbon. The spots. I know I have some left over. I thought, wouldn't that be cute? And then if you add, okay, say so you have the black spot cow ribbon, and then you, oh, you add the red check to it. You can add the yellow in there. There is so much you can do with this sign. And I'm gonna, I've got a couple more that I'm working on. Um, this one, 
I showed you last week, but I changed up the words. This is probably the one I'm going to do for the collaboration on YouTube. I actually have some little umbrellas. This is from a vintage postcard. And see the little duck playing in the puddle with his rain boots on? I, and the dog looks like he's looking right at him. I, that is my favorite. And then, I mean, I showed you all this one last week. You can, you can order this. This is on my Etsy page where I can personalize it with your name, your last name in the sign. So there's that one. Um, this one I love too. All things grow with love. And then my patriotic gnome. I will be getting him ready. So I actually have the two lemonade signs. I have this one and I have this one. And I have a third one. I have a pink one too. And they're all on my Etsy store. So, and we've got this one. If nothing changed, there'd be no butterflies. I mean, can you see that with this? Yes, doesn't it? It, it did me too, Tracy. I love the vintage postcards because they just add so much to a sign. All right, so we've got the welcome, the other welcome. Missed that comment. I'll go back and look. I'm sorry. And then you've got the one that Sue ordered for her kit. And then you've got the blueberry. And see how that rusted look to the sign? I, th I think they're awesome. Most of my signs are all $9, just for FYI. But I, I had to do the cow one because I wanted a daisy one. Yeah, they're already listed on Etsy. If you just, you know, like red truck, I'll be putting the pictures on tonight. And then the magnolia one that Sue wanted, the pink magnolia. And don't forget to hit the three little dots up at the top of my uh, Facebook page. That'll let you know when I'm on. And then you've got the, the two bike signs. Um, what else? The cow. We've got fish ones now. Oh, we have these too. This looks kind of rustic. And then we have freedom, you all. Or stars and stripes. Mm -hmm. So there you go. I think I gave you some ideas for summer. And then see, matches it exactly. And you all know my my bee gnome, my home is where you roost, my chicken one. Thank you, Sue. You, can, you guys can thank Sue because she's the one that started this whole farmhouse line. <laughs> I need, I need. And then we have our bike that we just have to figure out how to get our little bicycles in there. There we go. Was it worth waiting for? The signs is there anything you guys are looking for and can't find I know um, Missy sent me some ribbon she's got some uh, ribbon that has like it's not like no it was like blue I think blue I have the picture but I will look at it and please when you um, make something with one of my signs please send me a picture I post it on my other page, which is Robin's Wreath Signs and More, and they get posted there for everybody to see. 
and I'm, I'm trying to come up with a contest idea. We're going to have a contest, and somebody's going to win some signs. See, that kind of shows up really good against the pink. I like that. Does anybody have any questions? <laughs> Elaine, they came from uh, Michael's. I'm sure they have them again this year. I know they were there last year. They were $6, but I know I didn't pay $6. I know I waited till they were marked down. It's their Ashland uh, summer picks. Just have to figure out how to get them on there. How to mount them. I'm going to, I think, cut some of this off and just put it through the spokes there to put it in place. But see, that kind of pops against the pink, and that's what I wanted. But I wanted some purple in there, too, and we added the blue to the sign. I will go back. Hey, Steve. Hey. <laughs> Steve is learning along with Willie on how to make signs. He thinks the way I do. Right, Will? I love helping them. I miss them. We need another uh, conference in Rochester. So we can get together again and go shopping and go for pizza. Aw, oh, thank you. All right, guys, I'm going to head out. We still have a lot that we're doing. And please, please, please stay home, stay safe. What I need. Okay, I'll show you the. The girl with the umbrella again. Let me find her. She's the red check. Oh, thanks, Tracy. See, it says, can you read it? When rain comes your way, play in the puddles. I just love that, that vintage postcard. And when I came across the little duck in the puddle with the boots, uh, that had to go in there because it looks like the dog is looking right at that little duck. <laughs> I did, and I can do it both ways, all right? This is the way I had the wording on it the first time around, which I like, and you can see it really good, but I wanted you to look more at the picture and still be able to see the letters. And I was able to get the words bigger. So they're available either way. If you prefer it with the black lettering, I can, I can do it that way or I can do it this way, whichever way. But just, just look at the eyes on that dog. I mean, he's looking right at that duck. It was just perfect. His eyes are just like looking like. Oh. <laughs> I try to do serious, but I also love the whimsical little signs that I can put together. So there you go. And I, again, I'm sorry I couldn't see all the comments. I will go back and check it out and get back to you. Okay. I hope it was worth the wait. I am so grateful that you stopped by. And, uh, oh my gosh, there are so many daisy ribbons out there. I can just see that cow with all the daisy ribbon. 
I mean, look, we've got not so much the purple, but I mean, I know I've got it in the teal, or not the teal, the um, tan. I know I've got it here somewhere. Yeah. I mean, can you see that? <laughs> that and you add the D's. Oh, wow. Look at this. Perfect. Perfect. Oh, you are a sweetheart, Sue. Thank you. So there you go. There. Oh, look at this one. This would even be cute with it, too. All you have to do is send me a message or go to my Etsy store. If you go to my Etsy store, the frog one, you can order right on there. It asks you for your last name. Okay. And I will go ahead and add more bike ribbon because it's showing sold out on Etsy. And I found two more. That I didn't know I had <laughs> and a lot of times too if you can't find the ribbon and you saw me use it and you want the ribbon to match the sign all you have to do is send me a private message and tell me how much in yardage you want because I have everything priced out according to to um, the yardage like okay for instance all right this ribbon 49 cents a yard okay so you know that's even available to you okay all right guys i will try and get upstairs and go through your comments and answer any of them i'm just sitting here and i'm just blown away because i'm i'm recalling a lot of the ribbon and oh my gosh I could go nuts down here especially with this one. Oh wow I need to order some blueberries all right guys I thank you if you have any questions contact me if not I will see you on Wednesday um, although not sure about Wednesday. We have funeral on Wednesday that I probably I don't I don't know. It is what it is. Trying times. All right. Thank you. Thank you, Susan. Thank you, Levine. Thank you, Dawn. Thank you, everybody. Um, I so appreciate your support being a small business. So please, please, please stay safe. All right. Good night.